What's up guys, we are at the job site and here's what we're working with today. As you can see the soffit has gotten a little bit soft and rotten and fallen out. So we're going to be replacing all of it. It's getting a little soggy on the ends, that way it'll be all new on this whole gable end here. You don't see too many houses with wood soffit anymore. For right now they just want to fix it up before winter. And that way we can figure out a grand plan after that. And I tell you what, we've been so fortunate here in South Dakota because it's like 50 degrees today and we're only a couple weeks away from Christmas, so let's get started and get this done before the weather turns on us. Alright, as you guys can see, I already got uh, all my soffit pre-painted in the shop, that way it could stay warm, the paint could set up overnight, and uh, so we're ready to go with that. Let's just head up there and Clear the rest of this out. All right, there you go, guys. Now you can see what we got to deal with here. All we use is a quarter inch Nero Crown staple to pull this soffit up when we staple it up. And then we'll touch it up with some paint, a little bit of caulk. You can kind of see there's some squiggles in this fascia. And what happened was that kind of started bowing out over the years, and then that soffit had nothing to hold it in there. And it started hanging down, and the weather got to it and fell down. So we're going to have to try and screw them back tighter to that 2x4 to help hold that soffit panel in there. Alright guys, we are ready, getting ready to put our uh, soffit up, and I need to get some color match caulk for that job. So we're going to run there and see if we can find some caulk to match this. Good winner. And I tell you what, this new Milwaukee narrow crown stapler that they came out this year, love it. It makes everything so much easier. You know, you just get up there with one hand, hold with one hand, staple. Nice, works great. I did a review on this a while back. I'll tag it up here. All right, two pieces left. We're on a trim. There's another great tool from Milwaukee there. I use the 12 volt caulk gun. These things are a hand saver. Turn it all the way down and get a nice little even beetle on there. They work great. this one it's been a while since I've worked on old wooden socket but it turned out pretty good you guys have a good one we'll see you in the next video thanks for coming <laughs>